I'm Heather Lancaster with Sensationals and I have a really fun review for us today. We're going to do four fragrances and they include Fireside, Yummy Almond Biscotti, Evergreen Garland, and Santa's Workshop. And my son is home just on his way out the door to work. He's agreed to do a review of one of these so stay tuned to see what his favorite is and to hear a 19 year old's perspective on our fragrances. Out of the four fragrances that I'm reviewing today, Fireside is my absolute favorite. Um, I have an electric fireplace at home, and when I go to a friend's house and they have a real fire going, I know then that I miss the wonderful smells of the cedar and everything burning in there, and now I can have it without the cleanup and the mess. So the description on Fireside is, a blazing collection of birch, cedar, and spice, and it is fabulous. Very rich, very strong aroma. The top, you can smell that little bit of spice, kind of men's cologne spicy, I would say, versus baking spice. And the back, you smell the wood. If you ever open up a cedar hope chest, that is the smell that is on the back of here. It is absolutely fabulous. I think I'm gonna have to put this one on tonight while I have my fireplace going. Hi, I'm Kate, and I'm reviewing the Evergreen Garland scent today. I'll just go ahead and read the description. It's a citrus and berry holiday garland. It, uh, it's really good for Christmas. It's not too overbearing. It's light and it's, uh, it's very lemony and I'm, I'm going to smell it. It's awesome. Uh, the top side smells a lot like, like limes and oranges and lemons. It's very citrusy. It's fruity. And then the, uh, the bottom side smells a lot... It's really hard to get out. The bottom side smells a lot like berries. It's very, it's, it's actually really sweet. Um, it almost has a couple of hints of like evergreen boughs, kind of. It's really nice. Um, every time I come home and there's like a cookie or a pie scent, I always like to switch it to something way lighter. And evergreen garland is just a great switch. The next fragrance is Santa's Workshop. And the description on this one reads, Old Time Woodshop, Christmas Cookies, and Santa's Pipe. That's a whole lot going on in this little box. And I have to tell you, it comes together really nicely. If you smell the bottom notes, it's the very, very rich odor of Santa's Pipe. And the pipe, by pipe, I think what's really in there, it's very earthy and um, kind of like the fruits and the flavor that would go into a pipe that make the good smells. It's strong, but not so strong that it's overwhelming. I really love the pipe tobacco smell on this one. It's very rich and very masculine to me. Top notes are cookie. And I guess uh, if you were walking around Santa's woodshop, he would be eating cookies and smoking his pipe. And so right there for you, Santa's workshop. Our final fragrance is uh, chosen by one of our YouTube viewers. So if you would like me to review a fragrance for the future, leave me a comment right underneath this video and we will put you on our list of things to be reviewed. And so, Almond Biscotti was my choice today. And I love the request for this uh, particular fragrance because the viewer is asking, is it more almond or more cookie? Which I think, because I'm a cookie lover and an almond lover, is very relevant. So I pulled out my almond extract and I took a couple smells of that. And then I smelled the almond biscotti. And my initial reaction was, and still is, that it's more cookie. But then, you know, being the excellent reviewer that I am, I decided I should smell the bottom notes. The bottom notes of this fragrance are more almond, so you're going to melt this. I think both of your cravings are going to be satisfied. And my guess is, and I'm going to have to test this, but my guess is that when I melt this, almond is going to be dominant in this scent. So enjoy yourself. I'm going to go take some butter out of the fridge now to make sure that I have some almond cookies baking at the same time as I have this fragrance burning, or else I'm going to get in trouble from my kids. Thank you for joining my son Cade and I in our reviews today. I've got a couple other family members here who are enjoying the warmth of the fireplace with me. Um, I would also love to have you join us in reviewing your favorite fragrance. If you'd like to send me a quick time movie of your favorite fragrance to hlancaster at sensationals.com, then uh, we'll see you on YouTube with us. Say goodbye. Goodbye.